Welcome, welcome to another episode with Hodan. And in today's episode, what we're going to be talking about is the five top opportunities that may lay for you in the manufacturing sector, especially if you're thinking about what you go after for the manufacturing sector and which are the most profitable opportunities within the manufacturing. So if you stay with me until the end, I will give you a bonus tip as well something that you can go with. So stick with me until the end. And by the way, if you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe. If you are interested to finding a ways to tapping into the East Africa Kenyans opportunities and expanding your business and investing in the right places and what to do when you're coming to East Africa, what to avoid when you're coming to East Africa and especially in Kenya and where is the best to be and the insights in East Africa. So make sure you share too if you have friends that are might be interested as well to come. So let's go diving in quickly. The number one opportunity that you may think of is the agro processing as you know one of the biggest opportunity in kenya is the agriculture so in the manufacturing space there is a huge opportunity for you to enter the agro processing i mean yes there's a lot of agriculture going out of the country but don't forget, Kenya has 50 million people that needs feeding. So, and the economic class is lower as well. So you can think about if you want to make a huge opportunity, you could actually create that manufacture in the agro processing, providing the food within the country. So stepping into that space is a huge opportunity for you to access, thinking in a different ways and how you can actually put in place and make sure you watch my other video about the manufacturers and the way the strategies that you can start the second opportunity that you can actually tap into is the textile the textile and clothing is a place where you should think about it because this is a space where it's actually ex ex exploding in kenya especially in the fashion industry so instead of you know sending the products from outside to the country why don't you start building because cost wise is lower for you to actually produce because you have actually the huge worker space the labor is here that can actually do the work for you and it's a lower cost than you were doing in Europe America and elsewhere so Kenya and Africa is becoming the next China and India. So the lower cost is better for you to manufacture the textile and the clothing in here. And the, the middle class is actually growing in Kenya as well. So there's a huge opportunity for you to tap in the textile and clothing. The third opportunity is in the pharmaceutical. The pharmaceutical is a space where no one is like, it's not so much tapped but it's also regulated heavily. However, it's a space where the health sector is growing and the middle class is growing, where it's really needed a lot of manufacturers to be open. Obviously, Kenya is, the government is loosening up the regulation slowly, but allowing to accommodate. And there are different ways you can actually start the manufacturing, not necessarily immediately opening up, but you can also partner or reinvest or joint venture with another manufacturer existing already. If you have the arms, the, you know, the financials uh, means, then it's a different story. We can also help you to set up the pharmaceutical, but the opportunity is huge in Kenya for the pharmaceutical space. The number four, is the construction materials you could able to start the construction because there's a huge opportunity in space of the construction in Kenya and if you were able to 
uh, start the cementing and all of that different uh, manufacturing in Kenya, there is a huge opportunity for you because the construction and the buildings and the infrastructure is growing and the investment is heavy in Kenya. So if you having a cement company or instead of sending made already ready made, you can actually start establishing that, buy the machinery, bring the machinery in Kenya and get yourself ready and produce and sell it to the rest of other constructions and construction companies. So the materials is really needed. And I know for instance, Turkey have the best and Kenya has been interested so much with the designs from the Turkey and you can bring it them. So think about different, uh, the home designs, that anything that can help with the construction, you can actually produce them in Kenya instead of bringing from outside. And Kenya, if you didn't know, heavily tax the people bring product from outside. So the best is easier because there is a huge relief when it comes to uh, the manufacturing, uh, establishing your manufacturing company in Kenya. Let's look at the fifth, but not the least, and not the last, automotives. Automotive is one of the biggest opportunity in Kenya and obviously it's a huge used like operated um, space in Kenya I mean it's really it's more of counted more than the people in Kenya I think I feel like the, it's huge so what I'm trying to come and say here is that the automotive is having a huge opportunity so if you're having anything to do in with the cars and all that start producing in Kenya it will make it a lot of financial sense for you instead of importing it so there's a huge need for that and people are consuming so much on the automotive and the government of Kenya is having a huge uh, work around that and to make it ease to facilitate the automotive space so make sure if you're thinking about tapping in any of these opportunities to look further and as you have been until now here with me I would love to offer you uh, a bonus which is if you are interested in having further conversation around these opportunities or wanting to find further opportunities that you may able to tap into I'm providing you a 30 minutes of uh, free consultation and for instance if you are interested in you know concerns and you having a questions around that you can also feel asking me on the comment sections and make sure if you are booking the 30 minutes times with me please answer the questions so I can best help you and you can get the benefit out of that 30 minutes and if you want me to share more opportunities let me know in Kenya or in East Africa where are you thinking about and what are you thinking about to doing in this market so I can create more videos around that so I can investigate the opportunities around for you for that. So I'll see you in the next episode and if you have not yet commented, shared, liked or subscribed, make sure you do all of that so at least we can reach the rest of the people so we can actually grow and help this up with other people as well and if you want to know how you can start your business for manufacturing watch this video as i'm sharing there more in details the six steps that requires from you to starting your business i'll see you in the next episode Bye bye